problems that we uh, face in like our daily day usage of computers because we're constantly on the computers yeah. and they're making noise and they're getting hot. That's a pain in the neck, but especially if you're gaming. You know, if you're gaming, that machine gets smoking. It overheats all the time. Overclocking it, it overheats. <laughs> it's crazy overheating. <laughs> Tina's is on fire. But anyway, we're thinking, what can we do? How can we solve this problem? Well, Alan Nation right here, IT guy extraordinaire, sort of came up with a solution. I'm going to call it Strip PC. What do you call it? Well, I call it <laughs> making this thing quiet. Okay, and what did you come up with? Tell everybody. Okay, so um, I went on the web and yeah. found uh, a website that shows you how to take a PC, immerse it in vegetable oil, strip out all the fans, yeah. and bam, you've got no noise. No noise, keeps it cool. Keeps it cool. But the question is, does it work? Hmm. Can we find out? <laughs> yeah, we're going to try out right here. I've got an old uh, computer here that... Uh, so what have you done? You've gutted it. Well, so here, we, uh, here we've got a power supply here. Yeah. So first thing you got to do is you got to take out the fans out okay. of these guys. So you pull, rip this guy out. Now, so this, anybody take doing... Take notes. It, take notes. Those at home. Anybody doing it want to put this back on because last night I accidentally brushed up against it. Gave myself a little jolt. Did you like electricity. it a little? A little. <laughs> Felt good for a while. That's how I get my hair like this, to tell you the truth. And then here I've got a, one of the new video cards. You can see the fan mm -hmm. on it. Mm -hmm. take These off, guys. To take up all the fans. Give me the right fans. Out. I'm just the assistant over here. So. Mm -hmm. There we go. Hold that, okay. Vanna. And so now these, um, these heat, um, heat sinks here mm -hmm. are going to pull the heat out and put it into the oil. And then it just dissipates right into now the whole Now why vat. are we using oil and not like water? Well, when you go to the website, you're going to see that they did try it with water. Uh -huh. And they used uh, deionized water, okay. which means that it's uh, cleaned out, mm -hmm. no impurities in it. And it worked for a little while, but it caused a little short. So right. even, even the cleanest water they could find. And now, did they try other substances like maple syrup or jello? <laughs> no, I, I, don't I don't think so. That's... <laughs> All right, so what's next? Uh, so now you've got all the fans off. Yep. Took, took the fan off the CPU here. Mm -hmm. We took the fan out of the power supply. Mm -hmm. um, this video card didn't have a fan, but if yours has one, then you take it off. Mm -hmm. And now it's ready to drop in. So we're going to take this tank before your very eyes and fill it up with uh, good old fashioned vegetable oil. We're not going to say a brand. No, no, no. Just it's vegetable generic. oil. That's right. Oil. And, and why we do this, Alan, why don't you give people a little bit of a background of like, your history and why you know so much? Why you're an IT guy? Well, I've been working in IT for 15 years Kinda now. Spill, Tina. Yeah. And uh, mm -hmm. messing around with you hardware is what I like to do. You can help. And so this was really intriguing because fans and CPUs are getting so much faster and they're getting. Uh, they get hot and they make a lot of noise from mm -hmm. all the fans. You got to put five and six fans now in. And this is such a good idea. To <laughs> this is such a good idea. I don't know why. And I it's think fun of this. too. It is I a just want it fun. Get get some friends over. So now what easy, we're going to do is we're going to want to fully immerse the the computer. And if you're building one of these to just use at your house or um, at your office. Uh, you're going to probably not want an aquarium. Well, no. So now, once it's in and it's immersed in the oil, can it stay like that forever? It can stay like that. And what they, forever, recommend, ever? What they recommend on the site is a... <laughs> yeah. Is a, um, a circulation pump. Oh, and like a fish tank? Uh, no. No, it would have to be something <laughs> that could do oil. Oil is so thick yeah. that... Uh, I'm done that you need a pump that can handle something this thick. Wow. So That's where would you get a, a, a pump that thick that could handle the thickness like that, do you know? You know, I don't know off the top of my head. But where without the one? pump, this can go for... It can go for a long time. Quite if, a while. Uh, the, in, on the website, you'll see that they said uh, their, their unit they had hooked up, which was a pretty beefy CPU and video card, mm -hmm. got up to 104 degrees. Okay. Which is pretty moderate. And that's how long do you think it took to get that? 30 minutes. Okay. Yeah. okay. My job is done, and I don't trust either of you, so I'm going to let you guys do this. I'll see you guys in a bit. <laughs> hey, Tina Wood, everyone. I Tina Wood. You. Thank you. Tina Wood. Okay. All right. That's fine. You shouldn't trust me. Neither should you. Let's move on. Okay. So now what we're going to do is get some of this extra stuff out of the and way. Now, is it plugged in right now? Is the computer no, on? No, it's not but plugged in. We're going to turn it on, right? Yes. Okay. And is it connected to this monitor? Can we prove people that it's working? We're going to prove it. We're going to show the actual Because we don't want to fake you. Booting up. Okay. So what so we're going to do first. So the fans go goodbye. 
is before we even power it up, we're yeah. going to drop it in the oil. Okay. Can, can I help? Yep, you can. Okay, okay so just So now this is a plug, which is not plugged in. Okay, we will plug it in, though. Oh, a keyboard and everything. Yeah, we're going to have the full thing just like you would be doing it at home. It would be so awesome if you could get, like, fish that lived in oil and had fish swimming around your, your CPU thing. Okay, so go ahead and drop yeah. that bad boy in okay. there. There we go. No one like my fish idea? Mm -hmm. So now... Uh huh. Fully submerged. No smoke, no mirrors. Okay. Uh -huh. So what I'm doing is I'm keeping the uh, the cables out for the hard drive. Okay. And the power switch. And it's okay if and they the got LEDs. a little oil on them. It's all right there it's if fine. they got a little oil on them. Fine. So now we're ready to so plug now it we'll, in. So let's, let's let's give it some juice. Plug it in. Okay, I'll go There's ahead and do that. Right down here. I noticed right next to the um, fire extinguisher. Okay. Is, okay. So we're in. Now. Yeah. What you're gonna do now, is. What is this for? This. Is that for? that's. To plug into uh, oh, okay. your floppy drive or your CD drive. Okay. Okay, now if you want to, go ahead and hit that power button. You're going to let me do it? Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> I, bet, I don't think this is a... a, a Just push okay. her in. Okay. There we go. Okay, oh, now lights. you see the lights came yeah. on? Now it's going to be about five seconds, and we're going to see the... And I can use it right here with the little... Yeah. Check my MSN now. <laughs> so there we go. Hey! Our computer's up and running. Now this that is, doesn't look good. No, it, no, it just went to the BIOS because this is just an older computer that oh, okay. hasn't been used in a while. But gotcha. You didn't the, put your Alienware up in the oil. No, no, no. no. But uh, this is this is the computer actually running. All right, now this is so much fun. But before people at home go and try to do it, is there any sort of special precautions or preparations they should take or should know about? Yeah, once uh, when you go on the website, you yeah. can uh, see that they've got a, a few things that you want to pay attention to. One of them is. If you're using a socket style mother, uh, CPU, yeah. which we're not using here, we're using the slot style, uh, you're going to want to run epoxy around it and seal it up. Now, it goes into great detail on the website. Yeah. So we didn't cover it here, but if you're using one of those socket styles, be sure and go to the website and so take a look. This has epoxy here. Did you do that? That's that's the epoxy that I did, okay. uh, which turns out I didn't need it on you here. You didn't need to. So, but it can't hurt to be extra safe. Safety yeah. is first. Yeah, <laughs> and, and also, too, I've got here now what... You know, we're not doing hard drives or CDs or right, anything right, like right. that. Right, right, right. But the time. when they build their own computers, they're going to want to use these guys. So what you do is on the website again, you're going to see that yeah. they put the C they put the hard disk and the CD on top of the whole structure with a little shelf. Right. And then you've got your plugs here. That you do just, not submerge. Do not submerge. Do not these submerge. Guys. The CD will not play in the oil. Exactly, because that CD's spinning in there. Mm -hmm. The oil. And the spinning. No, that, that's not that's good. common sense. If you guys didn't know that, you shouldn't have a computer in the first place. And now, what about if I've got a really badass, fast, high-end machine? Am, am I really gonna dump it in some oil, or does it only work on the old relics? Well, no. On the website, go to the website. You're gonna see that they did a 2.1 gigahertz uh, processor on their motherboard, and they got a high-end video card. There you go. Put it all together. I mean, this is a good machine that people are gonna have for their gaming. That's right. They stuck it right in their tank. There you go. And Don't it be up. scared. And finally, I just want to point out real quick, no. Heat, no noise. We're down here, the old machine and that old, you know, old fashioned case like they were born, making a lot of noise and projecting a lot of heat. So, for gaming and for computer people who are sitting there all day, this is the way to go. Plus, stylish. Oh, yeah. Well, speaking of style, if yeah. you go on the website, you're going to see they have a really cool translucent box. Yeah. Well, we checked out with a couple of plastics manufacturers around here. You can get your own custom made plastic case. Right? And Throw it's not a little very expensive. food dye in there, a couple LED lights. This yeah. is what I'm talking about, the future yeah. of home computing. All right, everybody, this is Alan Nation, and we'll be back next Thank time you. with more fun tips to make your life easier. This is awesome. Thanks. I like it a lot.